being smart is really important in an F1 driver because when, for example, the lights go out and you've got 24 cars around you, in those days, you know, 20,000 RPM, everything's screaming, everything moving very fast in three dimensions. You actually, someone like you or me, or let's say me, we just sit there stunned like a pigeon on the road. Uh, to be able to manage, the, to have the spatial awareness, to be able to process at that speed everything that's going on and react so precisely actually does require a lot of intelligence. And so the acid test is whether a driver gets into a mess or not. And there have been some very good drivers who are just not smart enough and they're always in trouble. If something happens, they get caught in it. On the other hand, there are people, and I would say Alonso is the number one example, who just almost never get in trouble. They, whatever happens, they're just never there. And I, you know, like McCavity, the mystery cat. And, I, and that's a sign of real intelligence to me.